What's up, tubers? This is Ray from Rayware Computers. It's 1996. Showing you how to do your affiliate web pages and lead magnets, lead pages, bridge pages. Oh my. If you've been found out affiliate marketing, you're not alone. Allow me to guide you through all the mistakes I've made and how to recover from them. If you're having problems getting your affiliate thing going, stop. Go to rwcweb.com. Put your best email in that box right there. And I shall send you oodles and oodles of information on how to do this correctly. Now, if you look up here, got a free subdomain or free website through webstarts.com. This is a great way to practice. It's the ultimate drag and drop. Okay. Now, this here, what I did was I made this ebook. Okay on how to format your web page okay now you just use the picture that I made in Canva but I want to make that look like an ebook ebook okay and now what I did was um, I found this I actually had this old software that actually used to work in uh, Internet Explorer web browser. Um, somebody upgraded it and put it into a uh, like a Delphi program. Okay, it's not too bad. Um, but I found this online. Okay, so this is a pretty cool free ebook cover thing. Okay, and if it's for free, it's for me. Okay. So let's grab this right here and I'll show you how very quickly we can create an ebook cover out of a flat picture. Okay. That's what we want to use. I'm going to upload it. Okay. Uh, all right. So we're not going to use the spine. Let me go back, get one without a spine. Here we go. Uh, I like this one. Oh, this one looks pretty good. This one might match it more. But I like this one. Let's go without a spine. Next. Okay. Gonna get the picture. Upload it next and boom that's about it we're going to download it we're going to name it the same name except we're going to go 3d so we don't overwrite that old one okay now i created this in web starts i'm going to go into my web starts Okay. Let's delete this. We're going to add an image. Upload. Okay. Let's take a quick look at it first. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Looks like a real book. Very cool. I like that. If it's for free, it's for me. Remember that, gang. Okay? That's pretty awesome. Let's see if we can squeeze it in. Make it a little biggy wiggy to fill the room. Save it. View that guy. Ah, very cool. Very cool. Okay, and, and you know, I haven't formatted it or anything. It was just a quick, quick thing that I, that I did, you know. All right, we can try it with a different style. Let's go try it with a different style. Just refresh the page. Okay. 
try it with a different style. Let's do a frontal, being that the picture is more of a frontal. I remember now, we made the book, so I don't want to get... And I'm sure there's a requirement f for the... For the size, I didn't really read into this. I just kind of did it. It was so quick and easy. Okay. Download it real quick. I'm going to overwrite that other book. You want to overwrite as much as possible because you don't want to take up scores of room on your hard drives. Back to web starts. Get rid of that one. Image. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to get rid of this one on the server. Again, because then you wind up having tons and tons. Let's take a quick preview. Oh, that's kind of cool. And again, I need to probably reformat that picture. Okay, select it. Insert it, adjust it, save it. It's going to go here and refresh. All right, not too bad. Again, then it's unformatted. Um, it's definitely, we could try one more. All right, let's try one more. Let's go in here and delete that first. Go here, DIY book design. All right, let's see if, uh, see if this one don't have a spine. If we can get one looking towards us this way without a spine. The spine is another file that you gotta make up, All right? This has a spine. Let me see if I can find me a blank spine somewhere. But let's take the picture. All right, open it up. I think I got a, a blank spine somewhere. Browse. Desktop. Okay. Desktop. Where was that? I had a spine somewhere. Got to make the spine in a really, like, obscure type of, uh, yeah, here we go. Okay. So I did it with this one. All right, let's just try this one here. All right, upload. It's the binder, you know, the binder. Ooh. Wrong color, but that's all right. Let's drop it in. Overwrite the old guy. And rather than viewing it, I'm just going to go right to the chase. Insert image. We're going to delete this one again. Okay. I'm going to upload it. And then, you know, uh, if all else fails, just redo it. It's the greatest thing about the free stuff. It's kind of weird looking. And of course, this, this binder area. Oh, that's actually not too bad. Let's have a quick look at that, see how she looks. <laughs> Where'd you go? Refresh that. There she goes. Oh, that's wild looking. All right. Not bad, not bad. Okay. Let's fix her up. Okay. 
keep her like this. And again, you gotta, you know, you gotta go with their recommendations. On how to do it? Okay, not a bad thing. So this is Ray from Rayware Computers since 1996. If you've been failing at affiliate marketing, you're not alone. Allow me to guide you through all the mistakes I've made and how to recover from them. If you're having problems getting your affiliate thing going, stop. Go to rwcweb.com. Got my new YouTube channel going. I'm going to ask you to like and subscribe. You take care.